Hi, welcome to the Western Avenue Broadcast. My name is Josh. And I'm Amelia. Today we wanted to start our time by showcasing our super ticket winners for February 16th. We saw some super behavior happening in and around the school and we want to keep encouraging you to be super no matter what. It's already time for the fun fair. Really? When is it and what is the theme? Well, I think we'll find out the details in this brief message from the PTO sponsors. Olympics. What are you talking about? Didn't you see in the Western Weekly that we're hosting the Olympics this year? We can't possibly host the Olympics. That just sounds ridiculous. Wait, are you talking about the Western Avenue Fun Fair? Of course I am. I'm a huge fan of the Olympics and I am excited for this year's theme. Say it again. The Fun Fair will take place on Friday, March 15th from 5 to 7 p.m. There will be raffle baskets too. Please note that the winners will be announced at 6.30. What do you, what do you mean? Raffle baskets? I remember there being raffle prizes in the past, but baskets? I could just go to Goodwill and get one for $2. Oh so silly. The PTO tried something new this year and they asked each teacher to pick a favorite theme for the raffle baskets inside the baskets be the, a variety of items that go along with the theme. Room parents will communicate to families what donations will be needed. That sounds pretty neat. Does coming to the fun fair cost anything? Any child over the age of two will need a five dollar wristband in order to attend and play the games at the fun fair. Raffle tickets for the themed baskets are only one dollar each. Wait! Why do you have cans of food with you? Oh yeah, the third grade is collecting cans of food for the Northern Illinois Food Bank. Bring up to three cans of food for the fun fair, turn up to three regular raffle tickets to spend. That's a great idea. When can I get tickets? Click the link in the Western Weekly to buy your fun fair raffle tickets and entrance wristbands through Tuesday, March 11th. If you purchase them beforehand, wristbands and raffle tickets will be put in an envelope and sent home with the oldest child in your family at Western. Yes. Hey, um, I'm going to ask my family if we could go to that night. In the meantime, can I train with you? Sure! <laughs> looks like it's gonna be fun! While the third graders are collecting cans for our Northern Illinois Food Bank this month, the fourth graders ask that we please give you a heads up of, of their upcoming service project as well. Next month we will have more information about the fourth graders service project, but in the meantime they will ask you that you and your family please bring them bread tags that otherwise you might throw away. Last month the first graders finished their service project with Anderson Animal Shelter. A few first graders wanted to share how their collection went. Thank you to everyone who helped us with our service 
project for Anderson Animal Shelter. We were able to collect two fulls car, car loads of donations for the Savage Project. The shelter cats were also excited to get the toys we made them. And our adoption person recreated have already been used on their websites. We couldn't have been able to do this without you. Thank you! Have you ever gone to one of those to one of your specials and maybe you left their sweatshirt or hair accessories? Hmm, sweatshirt, yes. Hair accessories, not sure. Let's go to the lost and found where lost things end up, but we forget to find those lost items. Hi, uh, this is Asher, my name is Lily. Welcome to the lost and found shop where all the lost things are yet to be found. These jackets happen to be yours. We have a bright orange one, demonstrated by our beautiful model here. And then we have our North Face jacket. Thank you. We have this pearly one and an Under Armour one. Do these happen to be yours? Come to the Lost and Found shop today, where they can be found. We have many random items here at the Lost and Found. Sorry, continue. Uh, are those yours? Yes. One item has been found here at the Brilliant Store, and that is the Lost and Found. A variety of fashion accessories, including many headbands. Do these happen to be yours? Many scrunchies. Do these happen to be yours? And a baseball necklace, which we couldn't get on Asher, so I'm really sorry, but does that happen to be yours? A very large variety of water bottles and even some containers. Do these happen to be yours? Also have an assortment of wonderful gloves, like this monster, abominable snowman, fuzzy creature, but we only have one of them. So uh, if, if this is yours, also this is just from my hand. If this is yours, come to the Lost and Found today, because we have it, and it's ours now. <laughs> or these, um, rainbow gloves, pretty good. Pretty yeah, cool. and this one, which we all think looks like the Cheshire guy for joining us on this wonderful and tragic tale of the lost and yet to be found. Now, over to you. What we have for you. Thanks for watching the Western Avenue broadcast. Get him! The mystery of who is my owner. <laughs> Lifting weights. Look at you guys. Oh, fitness. <laughs> we can't possibly host the host. <laughs> we can't possibly. <laughs> Don't interrupt me. <laughs> you see that in the weekly western. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to ask my family to see if we can. That's can not even the go. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna ask my family if we can go to that night in the meat time. <laughs> can you believe it's already time for the fun fair? Really? And what? Is <laughs> can you believe it's already time for the fun fair? Really? What is it? And what time is the? <laughs> Can you believe it's already time for the fun fair? Really? When is it and what what is the theme? <laughs> Can you believe it's already time for the fun fair? Really? When is it and what time is it? Um, what time? Is it? <laughs> Can you believe it's already time for the fun fair? Really? When I must have really up. <laughs> Last month, the first graders just finished their service project with <laughs> 
it's gonna be in the bleeper. <laughs> Thanks for watching the Western Avenue broadcast. Get him!